Keeping it locked down, Laveau. Ah, uh, Sinclair. You think you deal with one thing. Yeah. You did a good job with Slim. The feds have him, but he's doing his damnedest to change that. But all that evidence... Uh, it's a start. But more folks in Sinclair need to speak up. And they can't if the Sheriff's Department and whoever else is terrorizing them. Where can I start? I can point you to some concerned citizens in Sinclair. Let me see what I can do to help. Thank you. Help them, and we'll be a step closer to keeping Slim Beaumont behind bars. Remus? Christian Remus. Esquire. And you're Laveau's acquaintance. Well, mind the mess. I understand you can help me get my Blanche back. Blanche, your woman? What's Slim one with her? Well, you see, I've had occasion to perform legal services for Sheriff Beaumont, along with some not-so-legal services. Now Slim's afraid you'll talk, but he doesn't want you dead. Which is why his thugs Kidnap my Blanche. You see, they're keeping her over in the scrapyard. The one that got blown up? I know it. Save her. Save her and I'll sing like a proverbial canary. Cause they're gonna pin this on us. You wanna keep your voice down? Slim's people are solid. The man looked out for us, we we'll look out for his deputies. Slim ain't been round. In case you haven't noticed. What you wanna do then? Tell him to leave? You wanna tell the police to get the fuck out and be my guest? In the meantime, keep your head down, your mouth shut, and look useful. Every nigga passing through. Fuckers gonna think they got a free pass. Nah, you know what this is? Slim being in lockup? This is an opportunity. For? For us to step up. If Sinclair's finest can't take care of business, who are folks gonna turn to? The Southern Union? Goddamn right, boy. 
<laughs> we play our cards right, mm. and this time next year, well, we gonna be running things. Who? We ain't got time for who, what, when. Go out the back way. Christian's waiting for you at his place. Get those assholes. All right?
figured you'd be in the wind by now. Well, there's a two o'clock train ticket with our names on them. Fake names, of course. But you'll testify. If it means not having to look over my shoulder for the rest of my life, yeah. Yeah, I'll testify. You take care of her now. Thank you.